Hello everyone. Welcome to our channel Cook with Cookie. We try to keep ourselves healthy. As a mother or as a wife, we should be healthy ourselves and also we should take care of our family's health too. With simple ingredients available in the kitchen, let me show you how to prepare wheat flour sesame seeds laddus that is very much healthy. I'll discuss the health benefits. Please watch the video till the end. So, first of all, take a pan and add 1 cup of sugar and add 2 cups of water and allow it to melt. Now, on the other hand, take another pan and add 3 tablespoons of ghee and allow it to melt. Now, once the sugar is all melted just add cardamom powder or elachi powder just for the flavor that add, that takes the recipe to another level now once the sugar is melted now turn off the stove and put it aside now our ghee is all melted now add one full cup of wheat flour into the pan and fry it nicely you can see the wheat flour changes the color into a little bit of dark creamier color dark cream color so that is when you need to turn off the stove now once you turn off the stove you need to add the sugar syrup into the pan so you sh you don't need to get the string consistent one string or two string consistency just allow the sugar to melt and put it aside now turn off the stove and then mix it nicely so that there are no lumps in the pan so once you're done mixing it now turn on the stove and put it on low flame and stir it nicely for good seven minutes you need to stir it continuously if you stop in the middle the bottom of the pan will burn now after seven minutes you will get this consistency it will get harder and also it starts leaving the pan this is the perfect consistency for preparing our laddus now turn off the stove and allow it to cool and then you can take it in or transfer into another bowl see it's nicely uh, leave the pan now take it into a bowl and then once it is cooled down that is lukewarm then you can prepare laddus you can prepare laddus anything of your choice but i prefer preparing them in a medium sized lemon sized laddus here so here i have prepared like this as shown here see you can prepare the same with the remaining mixture also and then put it in a plate now on the other hand i have taken white sesame seeds you can take black also or you can mix both and you can use it now sesame seeds are rich in calcium and magnesium and they are good for our bones it helps keep our bones it helps to keep our bone healthy and strong now instead of dipping the laddus directly into the sesame seed bowl take a bowl and add sesame seeds and then start rolling it so that the sesame seeds gets coated nicely evenly on all if the you edges. dip directly into the sesame seed bowl what happens is you more quantity of the sesame seeds will stick to the laddu and that won't be very nice and kids doesn't love that as shown in the video you do this and you can have perfect texture and taste of this wheat flour sesame seed laddu that's it our laddus are all ready so prepare this and put it in an airtight container and place on your dining table that's it your kids will run here and there and they'll just have it as an evening snack or morning breakfast or you can even put it in their tiffin boxes or lunch boxes also even elders would love to have it because this is that smooth inner side and on the inner side and also the sesame seeds that gives an amazing taste now both wheat flour and sesame seeds have good health benefits they are rich in carbohydrates fiber magnesium and calcium and they also give good health for our bones our heart our digestion and water not i hope you will try this recipe and also enjoy this amazing taste please subscribe our channel and also like share and comment thank you